the Crusaders made it to the walls of Jerusalem, where the governor commanded around 3,000 defenders. The Crusader army was relatively small, comprising about 1,200 knights and 12,000 infantry. A turning point came when the fleet ships arrived, providing provisions. These ships were disassembled to construct siege towers. As the Crusaders advanced the towers, they faced a hail of arrows, stones, and Greek fire, resulting in many Crusaders being burned alive. The city was eventually captured, but the aftermath was gruesome, with over 70,000 people massacred. The scale of the killing was so immense that Crusaders waded through blood up to their ankles.